join us as we go on a road trip from southern New Hampshire into Maine and then up into Nova Scotia. We put a kazoo in the sky. Huh? <laughs> so after an awesome day of driving, we're gonna have some dinners now. And Victoria's gonna cook them. Mm -hmm. You're gonna get it all out for me though. <laughs> Just cleaning up camp. Starting to sprinkle a little bit. Just have some of our leftovers. Fire is still going, which is nice. In the end, it's morning. Didn't get a whole lot filmed last night. Got way too dark. It rained like crazy, though. truck and the little tent thing we have set up around it held up awesome. After a night camping in a rainstorm in Maine somewhere, we make our way north to Canada. Mike is in the back. I, I did all the landscaping. Do you I, still I, own that house? Yeah. Okay, because I recently... It's the American flag alley here. So we made it into Canada. No problems. We're in New Brunswick. It's foggy, it's raining. We're driving at 110 kilometers per hour. an unknown amount of money for gas because I don't know how the gas pumps are set up here. View. Yeah?
dank, dark forest. What was that? Who turned on the orange filter? <laughs> Look at this. It's just the sky. Are we gonna have a tornado? So we made it to Cape Brenton Island. Mm. Staying at this random campground here. It's like easy break campground or something. It's basically just an RV park. But we're the only dummies without an RV. And yeah, I don't know. We're chilling. It's gonna rain again for sure. We're gonna have a fire, but it's just full of freaking trash. So I don't want to deal with that. Anyway, we're gonna get the window shut here because it's obviously gonna rain here in a minute. Okay, this is why we've been driving for three days to come to this playground. No, it doesn't spin. It's just a seesaw. Beauty toddler. I don't know if I Kind of a gross looking lake, actually, to be honest. Or a gross looking beach, anyway. It's kind of murky and filthy looking. Looks like it is the ocean, right? This is yeah, like weird. It's an inlet. Weird ocean stuff. Oh shit, look how dark it just got up there. I'm walking back in the rain. I don't want to, let's leave now. So the rain has started. We're taking shelter. We have our one candle going to protect us from bugs. You still getting wet though? From the splatter on this biker? Sit over here. Oh, okay. That's about it. If something awesome happens, we'll film it. But we probably won't. So we've had breakfast and we're gonna get packed up and get out of here. That's all we're really doing at this campsite this morning. Check out a random mountain dirt road I found on the map. Looks pretty cool. There's like a warming hut at the top. So I'm hoping it kind of drives up to the peak of like a mountain or something or a summit. And 
we'll see how it goes. We're about eight minutes from it right now. So we're on the road. So it's like a logging road or something. Use at your own risk. So I guess we're allowed to drive on this. Just see where it goes and see if we can see anything cool, I guess. Found a random runway in the middle of the woods. Up some random logging trails, and there's someone camping here. What the fuck? They can't be used anymore. Oh, I'm sure they do. Little planes, little bush planes. finished our little dirt road adventure. It didn't really lead to anything. All right, it's kind of stupid really, but whatever. We were planning on heading up to Meat Cove, but we found a construction worker who said it has like hills have eyes kind of shit vibes to it. So, uh, I don't know. <laughs> if we're really gonna go up there or not. This looks cool. We're in the Highlands National Park area, I guess. Almost up to Pleasant Bay. We just found this random beach area. It smells like gross ocean. <laughs> it smells like, you know what? Yeah. Dead fish. Well, something else. And <laughs> touch the water. Ooh, yeah. I did it. I touched it. I'm not touching it. Check it out. Check out this view, yo.
welcome to our campsite for tonight. It is a random spot on the side of the road that you can pay $20 Canadian to stay. So we did. Driving a lot today, saw a lot of cool things. Uh, this is where we're gonna hang our hats for tonight. It's really not too bad actually. We seem to have it all to ourselves, at least for the moment. And this little river down here. Tonight's feast will consist of a turkey sandwich and related accoutrements uh, and snacks and things, whatever we got. And we took a sandwich, which is turkey, cheese, bread. Mustard, and then we got a beer. Crazy Angus double IPA. Never had that, so don't know if it's good or not. You know what you're gonna eat today? I already ate. You already ate a pizza from a gas station. And technically a convenience store. That's true. Slash liquor store. Yeah. Slash market. Yeah. And deli. Yeah. And ice cream shop. Yeah. And bank. It's one of those. So after that awesome turkey sandwich, we've been playing chess for a bit. <laughs> it's like two wins, me, two wins, Victoria. Although she won't admit that she's won this one. I haven't won this one yet. Okay, I'm black. She's I don't even won. know what to do at this point. How hmm. do I get you in a position with checkmate with just the diagonal guys? Well, I think you just won by default because there's no way I could ever beat you. You could definitely still win. You have to just get me in check. Me. Well, it's the morning after our late night chess game. And my turkey sandwich went well. Two wins for me, two wins for the lovely wife. I got some sleep. So I'm gonna have some breakfast, some coffee, and then we're gonna go hike the Skyline Trail, which looks very nice. All right, we're gonna go down the Skyline Trail now and fall off the cliff and get eaten by a bear. Okay, well, let's not put that into the universe. We're gonna have a wonderful hike. We're gonna make it to the shoreline. We're gonna look at some cool ocean. Hopefully not die on the way there. We won't, it's fine. It's good. Beware of moose, bears, and coyotes. No dogs allowed on trail. Careful. Moose. The Victoria Moose. <gasps> That's my wife. <laughs> I wonder if this is like keep animals out. Okay. So this is the Jurassic Park fence. We're crossing. <laughs> I just see a giant fucking dinosaur. There's gonna be T Rexes on the other side of us. I don't want to see a moose. I don't want to go into an area with no moose.
something. <laughs> so we enjoyed that hike. It's pretty cool. We made our way down out of the mountains into the town of Cape North. And we're continuing the drive on the Cabot Trail. This is a little side excursion called the Coastal Loop, which is a, seems to be a much smaller road that just hugs the coastline here. It's really nice views. You can see the mountains that we just came out of. And strangely, it smells like weird lunch meat. Is that us? Is it my truck? Or is it the air around me? I don't know. It's you. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all the nice Canadian houses and the Canadian boats. It's a one lane bridge. Canadian potholes.